fantastic effort, man. I mean, from the back of the grid to get third place, unbelievable. You must have ridden your heart out there. I did, Sid. To be honest, I'll sleep tonight after that one. Um, I knew I had to get get the job done in the early laps, and I, I had a good run. Not many people's got in my way. But obviously, it got the pace to run at the front, but from the back of the grid, what a tall order. But just thanks to the lads around me, I mean, we had a mishap this morning, ended up at the back of the grid. Good points on the board, one of them. See what we can do this afternoon from the back of the grid again. Unbelievable. Well done, John. Cheers, sir. Thank you. Lee, you've got to be happy with that. I mean, that was an unbelievable ride, given that you've got, you're carrying an injury on the wrist there. Yeah, I could only do what I could do, and the aim of the game this weekend was to get points. Uh, damage limitation with me not being fit with a place that was only got done 15 days ago, but I mean, yeah, I've got points, so we'll move on to Cadwell stronger in the, the next race this afternoon, so. Yeah. Absolutely unbelievable ride, well done, mate. Thank you. Yeah, it felt like it was a little bit unfair, to be honest, with John having to start from the back from a technical problem earlier. But, um, so I didn't feel like it was a true race. Uh, I'd rather have John been there and Lee been there so we could have a proper dice for it. It's, it's, not, it's not a satisfying win, but uh, put the lap record and a personal best around the circuit, that's, that's the satisfying bit for me. But as a race on a whole, no, it wasn't, it was not, they want a battle, so, it, so it's, it's, not, it's not the same. Oh, but it was copybook anyway, and well done on the lap record. Cheers, thank you. Congratulations anyway, our top three in the Monarchs, Thomas Paul, GP3 Sportsman. Terry Merritt, Will Harper, and Michael Austin, our race winner. Well done, guys. You didn't tell me what really went wrong this morning. Obviously, you don't really want to embarrass yourself, but off the back of the grid, third place, happy with that? No, just for the record, I put Diesel in the bike. <laughs> ah, it doesn't, it doesn't like that, Ben, does it? It didn't, definitely didn't like that. It flew fine while with it all, but I just got down to Alan Ben, and it just... Just like hydraulic. So. Saves, me, saves me telling everybody anyway. Yeah. Oh well, you've admitted it now. Yeah, yeah. So it wasn't the petrol tap then, you just forgot to switch the petrol on. No, nothing that simple. Just the wrong pump at the garage at 12 o'clock last night, that's what it was. Oh well, use another garage next time. Well done, John, third place. Lee, suffering a little bit, broken wrist, hard work out there this afternoon, pretty hot. Uh, happy with second? Yeah, I can't not be, can I? Um, just struggling in the chicane, just breaking, but no excuse, and out there we're racing and it is what it is. Well done, I'd say double points as well today, so that's going to help you no doubt through the year. Yeah, every every point counts, you know, I made up for it, Donington with third, so we'll just carry on chipping away and we'll see what happens. Well done, Lee, anyway, I'm still up there, as I said, a new lap record, well done, I forget that was about lap six, something like that. You put a couple of quick laps in uh, and then dropped it off a bit. You're going to disappear obviously soon if you don't do your TT stuff. But obviously the double point of today is going to kick you uh, up there with these guys. So you're going to come back fight for it when you come back for the island? Yeah, you know what, well, the TT is the important one for us. We've got to be there. There's no way around that. That's where most of our sponsorships are based. So. But, yeah, like I say, we're still with the points we can gather today. It's probably still a shot, shot of the championship towards the end of the year. So we'll come back, see what the situation is, and just keep, keep having a little digging in and see where we end up. So, top of the podium, nice trophy, double points but probably more important than that record, eh? Yeah, lap record, for sure, that's the big one. Not, the win wants to satisfy now, didn't have John and didn't have Lee in the mix, it's not the same. You need a good battle at the front to make it worthwhile, so uh, hopefully sometime in the near future we'll be, we'll be back to business with these two. Good luck on a single race day today, so no uh, mega laps tonight or changes, John, you've got to do it all again.
Gary, third place, you must be happy with that. Yeah, it's very happy, especially after the uh, first race when I broke down, so yeah, all good. Excellent, what was wrong with the bike? Uh, just to get it again. Yeah, leave it fell off. Stamping on it too hard, obviously. Never mind, well done on the third place. Let's move across then and have a word with Michael. Michael, I think you did a little bit of grass trapping almost there, yeah, didn't you? A bit too much, once or twice, I think. Just in the same place, that's a bit of a rookie error, but he was pushing me too hard, I think. Well, that's what it's all about. Second place, uh, you can always uh, say I am in at uh, Cabwell. Exactly. Good luck, Max. <laughs> So, uh, Will, again, the season started off quite nicely for you. He did a little bit of grass track, but you managed to keep it between the, uh, the white lines and on the grey stuff, I think. Only oh, just. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to say, I didn't mean, hear any report that you'd gone off. Oh, it was close. Um, no, it's just wish you'd make it a bit easier for me. It's, uh, well, he was trying. I know. <laughs> so was I. Yeah, but he was trying to make it uh, easier for you. But never mind, he stayed on it, that's the main thing. Congratulations to the top three then. Give him a big hand, ladies and gentlemen. The GP1 Monix sportsman, Gary Woodward, Michael Austin and Will Harper. So then, let's start with the presentation. The nickname of the Ram has gone out the window. He's now known as Diesel Boy. Come on, John. John Ingram, third place. And with it, Diesel Boy, comes his envelope off the back of the grid, up to third, well done. That's uh, Adam's dad, so uh, that's where the thanks needs to go. Well done, John. Second place, I forgot who it was, Michael Evans. Fantastic ride. Come on, Michael. Good to see you up the front there, Michael, and doing extremely well with some uh, very experienced runners. We'll have a chat in a moment or two. But this is going to be a popular win. Lee Williams! <laughs> Complete with the Michelin app, sponsored by Michelin. Well done, Lee. <laughs> Got a smile on his face. I think that's the first time this weekend. So, let's have a little word with Diesel Boy. John. I think that's a better nickname than the Ram, isn't it? But uh, off the back of the grid again, a lot of work for you. Yeah, it was hard work, but you know, fair play. You know, the incredible winner here. He's uh, won the championship last year. He's had a good run today. You know, we we need to keep this championship alive. We want it to be close. We want to enjoy the rest of the season. So let's just go and keep this momentum going, and you know, keep it quite close to the end. Well, fantastic racing uh, we've seen so far this year and again today. And of course, somebody else coming in down there in second place, uh, just making it a little bit more difficult. Yeah, I was just having a chat with him yesterday, just giving him a few points and uh, wish I hadn't bothered now, to be honest. <laughs> well, you should keep your secrets to yourself, shouldn't you? Let's move on and have a quick chat. Michael, you must be happy with second place coming in at Alton Park up against this third quality field. Yeah, over the moon. Did not expect this at all. It was just a bit of a shakedown before TT, but yeah, to get on the podium is pretty, pretty mad. And uh, what about Lee? You were holding them at bay for quite a, a length of the race, probably about five laps, I think it was. Yeah, I was, I was really surprised. I kind of not led a race before, and I was like, uh, I didn't really know what to do, so I had plus zero, and I knew it was going to be and then um, still broke it inside me through the um, chicane, straight onto the grass and Lee went past but uh, it was good to see, good to see some lines and lines to so 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 some quicker guys. Well you've certainly given them a good run for their money. Lee, as I said, smile on your face I think for the first time this weekend. A win in the bag, you're happy now? Yeah, more, you know, it's points. No, I'm happy to win but most of all I'm happy to win that race because Adam is my best mate and I've tried for Four years, three years on a thousand, on a six hundred, you know, I've actually finally done it, got my name on a trophy, so I definitely proud of him. You know. Well, the only man that's standing next to you, John Ingram, has got his name on it already. He was the only other man that could probably have won it twice. But congratulations on that. Sean, maybe you'd like to make the presentation of the Adam Boyle Trophy. For those of you who don't know, Adam was a rider with Thundersport GB. Uh, rode here on the, uh, the Saturday with us in the, uh, the big white class and unfortunately was tragically killed on the way to work I think it was the following day on a little 125 on the road when he was hit by a vehicle uh, and that uh, resulted in a fatality unfortunately. So we thank his mum and dad for being with us and uh, we look forward to uh, remembering Adam again next year at this championship. Congratulations Lee, you must be glad to get your name on that one then. 
Excellent, well done indeed. Our top three then in the uh, G and what I've got to tell you before I get rid of these guys, don't forget your transponders, they need to go back. Our top three then, give them a big hand, John Ingram, Michael Evans and Lee Williams.